Man, getting fired sucks. Imagine working super hard just for some guy to come over, tell you that you suck and that you're never allowed to come back. That's crazy. But some people, some people just be setting themselves up for massive failure. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy, Orange Guy Animations. And I had a color class. And I was quite excited for this class because colors are awesome. So this class was pretty early in the morning. Okay, man, 7.30 isn't that early. I mean, I guess if you go to sleep at three in the morning, then 7.30 is pretty early. But you're subscribed to Orange Guy Animations, so you don't go to bed that late, right? Why have you been staying up so late? You better get your rest! So I went to the first class, and I noticed there was a bunch of kids sitting around outside. Hey bro, are we waiting on the teacher? Oh, I don't even know, bro. Hey, why ain't no wait, boy? We were indeed waiting for the teacher, and we ended up waiting around 30 minutes! Oh my god! And then our goofy teacher finally showed up. So we were all able to go inside, and the teacher decided to introduce herself. Um, hello class. Uh, my name is- We do not care. So the teacher finished introducing herself and obviously we, we do, do not, not care. care. But there was something that she said that was very interesting. Oh man, you know, getting up for class was so tough. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm just such a night owl. And I'll, I'll make sure I do my best to get to class, guys. Why would she say that? Why would she set herself up for such failure? Talking about some, I'm such a night owl. Because I'll tell you what, bro. This fool was late every single day of the semester. Not to mention that she didn't even teach anything. This fool would show up to class and just sit around. Oh my God. Bro was an L teacher. But what goes around comes around, bro. Even if you'd hate to see it. So at this point, there was basically nothing left to do in the class. And everyone was aware of the teacher's shenanigans. The only reason I even went to class on the final day was because I needed to pick up a project and I also needed to ask the teacher about a separate project. And I was hoping she didn't pull up seven years after class started. And it's not like this teacher was a bad person or anything. She just really did not want to get up for her class. And that was a huge mistake. So I pulled up to class and hey look, everyone isn't waiting outside. But I did notice this older guy in a jumpsuit headed toward the class. I assumed he was just an electrician or something, and I walked right inside. But to my surprise, I saw the electrician guy on a computer, which was a little weird. But hey, whatever. So I said hello as I walked by, grabbed my project, and I headed to my seat to wait for the teacher. And of course, after a while, the rest of the class showed up but we ended up waiting an entire hour and the teacher still wasn't there. But some people weren't having it. <clears throat> uh, what time did you guys' class start? Ah, yes. Um, our class starts at 7.30, but um, it, it seems our teacher is a bit late. Is she always this late? Uh, um, I think it was something with her, her roommate. She had to, to drop her off or something like that. <sighs> That's a shame. Because you see here, I'm the art director, and I came here to supervise this class. Oh, no. Our teacher's literally gone, bro. I'm about to see her in the streets. All because she didn't want to show up on time. Uh, what are you guys even supposed to be working on anyway? Um, 
we we are finishing our our printing press project it's literally the end of the year and you still haven't had a critique on it yet when was your guys last critique you guys haven't had a single critique bro we ain't never done no critique bro i was just sitting there shaking my head in disbelief because our teacher is literally about to lose her entire job because she's such a night owl and me shaking my head gave the art director everything he needed to know all right guys i've left my email here on the board right here and uh, i encourage you to email me and let me know about this class you have here and i deeply apologize and i wish you all some luck and with that, the art director left. But I couldn't leave yet, because I still have to ask this fool something. So after the art director left, it took the teacher another 30 minutes just to show up. And uh, I think she got the message because when she checked her phone, I could see the concern on her face. I did what I had to do and dipped. Because, man, that, that's a tough situation to be in, bro. And kind of deserved. Moral of the story, sometimes you have to switch your mindset in order to be successful. Because being a night owl definitely won't help you get to that 7.30 class. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Yo, what's up, guys? End cards, orange guy. Hey, look, I did a normal end cards, orange guy intro. Woo. Um, yo, bro, Tears of the Kingdom, game of the year, bro. That game is so fun. It almost, I'm, you know, I don't think it even really took me away from making videos. I'm just so good at making videos. That's why you should subscribe. But, uh, uh back to that later. Bro, the game's so awesome. Super cool. You should play it if you don't have it. And, um, if you don't like it, you don't have a brain? Question mark. Um, anyway, subscribe. You know, I'll shoot your family as I usually do if you don't subscribe, so um, make sure you do that. <laughs> subscribe!